Good morning. Welcome to our Godly Play classroom. Let's look over at our church calendar. As you can see, we are in the green and growing days. And over the next few weeks, we're going to talk about what it means to grow in our, in our Christian faith. There was once someone who loved us so much that he gave his life so we could come close to God. People followed him, but they weren't sure exactly who he was. And so one day when they asked Jesus, who are you? He said, I am the light. And that light is with us even today as we get ready for our story. I wonder what helps you to get ready for the story as you're at home watching this. So for me, I like to get in a comfortable position. So maybe you need some pillows or a blanket or your favorite stuffed animal. Just get comfortable until you're ready for the story. Are you ready? In the beginning, God was And God's spirit was everywhere. God created everything. God created people. God created people of all colors. And God said that God's creation was good. Sometimes people hid from God, but God was always there. God is as close as your breath. Sometimes we feel God in that deep, deep place that we call our heart. And we know that God loves us. Sometimes God calls us and we say, here I am. And God sends someone in our lives to show us how much God loves us. God also comes close to us through creation. And we experience God through all of our senses. We come close to God through what we see and through what we hear, even through what we smell and through what we taste and what we can touch. And when we come close to God, we can say, God, I'm listening. Sometimes God comes close to us through the sacred stories of the Bible. We welcome God in these stories and through these words. We can also come close to God through the life of Jesus and the example that Jesus led. Jesus told stories about God's love, and those stories are called parables. We can come close to God through parables also. Through all of this, we can practice listening because listening is one way that we come close to God. I wonder what part of this story you liked best. I wonder what part of this story is about you. I wonder if there are other ways that you have heard God or that there you have come close to God. And I wonder, what are some of your favorite ways 
to grow with God. Let's change the light. As we change the light here in our godly plague classroom, we know that the light is not gone, but that the light of Jesus is with each one of us, no matter where we are.